RG 107DX or the Yamaha 112V or J, uh, depending on your budget. Well, they are both in the in around the same price range, so it's not a really weird question which one you should buy. Um, but one of the first first things you'll notice is that this Ibanez guitar uh, actually has the real metal look. So if you're not going to play metal, then I think you should go with another type of guitar because this will stand out in any other type of scenario. So if you're playing blues or if you're playing grunge, um, then uh, even if you're playing rock, then this type of guitar is just doesn't look right because of the shark fin inlays. It has this metal look and everyone will expect you to be playing metal. Um, that being said, uh, there are quite a bit of differences uh, between the two. And the first thing you'll notice is the different fretboard and the different fret radius. So the Ibanez guitar, the action is actually really, really low. And that's because of the Ibanez patented wizard necks. They have medium frets with 24 uh, jumbo frets and easily accessible, even the high notes because of the cutaway. Um, but uh, the real thing that makes it a metal guitar is that the action is really low makes it easy to play like fast shredding licks. So that's one of the first things that you'll notice if you pick one of these up and, and uh, compare it with the Yamaha guitars. Um, that being said, I think the Yamaha if you're not going to shred or not going to play metal, then it has a better sound and a better clean sound than the Ibanez does. Uh, and that's because, especially in the 112V, you have the uh, ability to split coil the humbucker at the bridge, um, which gives it a more of a Fender style, Stratocaster style twang. Um, so you can use it in a lot of different styles. So the Yamaha is, is definitely the more versatile one. bit of a twang out of this one. Uh, let me go to my clean patch over here. So this is the bridge humbucker. And actually you have five settings uh, that's the same on the Yamaha guitar. Uh, and you can uh, switch between the bridge, uh, the coil split, uh, or out of phase between the bridge and the middle pickup, uh, then just a middle pickup, which is a single coil, which gives it a bit of a more versatility than other Ibanez guitars. Um, and it's, it's good for funk and, and, and light uh, rock style music. Um, so if you're going to play metal and you want uh, a bit more of a versatile sound, then this is a great guitar. 
um, if you're definitely not going to be playing metal or if you're not sure which is the is the playing style for you then i would not choose this one i would actually choose the yamaha 112v um, over the 112j uh, because the the versatility it has with the call split um, in the bridge and you're definitely going to miss that if you don't invest in the v um, or go for a squire type stratocaster fender squire um, the um, classic five series classic Classified 50s, for example, they are also great. It's a bit of a higher price range um, than both this one and the Yamaha guitar, um, but they give you a lot more versatility to play um, different kinds of styles. So I hope this video has helped you with your choice, uh, which guitar might be suitable for you. Um, and subscribe to my, ch to my channel to uh, watch more of my playing and watch more of my gear advice. Thanks so much for watching.